Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. In the previous video, we have seen how to configure the test bed in an isolated service we have seen. That is nothing but here logger.service.spec.es. We have configured with the test, test bed. Now let's move a little bit further. That is nothing but a service which has a dependency. Previously, we apply test bed to the service which doesn't have any dependencies. That means isolated one. Now we want to apply the test bed functionality to this service which has a dependency of logger service. So let's try to see this one. Without using test bed, what we have did here, if you try to see calculator service.spec.es, we have created as Jasmine's create spy object for the logger service and we have created the instance using the new keyword. So now we want to introduce the test bed so that the test bed will take care of injecting the services whatever the calculator service needs. So we don't want to provide this like this mock logger service and all those things we don't want to provide. So let's test bed takes care of everything. How the angler takes care when we create and uh, when we want this service like just like that test bed has to take care of everything for creating the service and all the dependencies which are needed for this calculator service it need to be injected. So now let's try to implement this one. So for implementing this what we need to do here let's create the test bed dot configure testing module and in this one what we need to do so we need to have the providers these are not components so we need to add it in the providers so it's an array first one is the calculator service and next one is the another in another provide another service which which wants which needs as a dependency injection for this one so here i need to provide provide so I want to have logger service as we are doing the mocking thing. So here I need to add it here mock logger service. That's it. Finish. So we have created the test bed and now we don't want to use this new keyword. So what we need to do. So let's remove this new keyword and here for the calculator. So we need to have the calculator instance. So calculator is equal to test bed dot inject so we need to inject it right so inject what is that one we need to have calculator service okay so that's it so now we have come we have uh, we have created the instance for this one and also we have completed right now let's try to see the output so now let's try to run it so let's stop this one and run npm test again so let's try to run this npm test let's see so the application has run successfully and we are getting some errors. So let's try to see the test case here. It is telling that spy logger service has been called once. It was called zero times. So that means there was no logger service. So let's go to the code and see here. So what is the fail? What is that one fail? Should subtract two numbers. Should subtract two numbers. So here we are trying to call this mock service dot log and it has not been called it is saying. So what would be the reason? Okay, here we need to use use value not user value. Okay, let's try to see the output. So here now the test cases has been success. Yeah, so here if you try to see the test case all got success. So now we have created the instance for this calculator service without using the new and now this calculator service if you try to see in the class file it needs the logger service. Now test bed takes care of everything. When you inject this calculator service, now the, the test bed came, comes to know that, okay, this calculator service needs the logger service. It was already been initialized. So automatically it will inject that one into here, mock logger service. Now if you want this mock logger service instance also, what you can do? So you, it's nothing simple. So you can have, you can directly use this mock logger service as it is by thing, or otherwise you can do something like, logger service service spy is equal to testbed dot inject and here you can use logger service we need to have the logger service right as this one is a jasmine spy object if you want you can add like this type typing thing spy object which for which one it is logger service yeah that's it so now this logger service we need to use it everywhere so you can implement this one. So logger service pi and this one is of type jasmine. Sorry, jasmine 
dot spy object and this is of type logger service that's it and here log log service okay this one is done so you can have this one as a constant okay so this one is usually here in this one only right in the before each only and we can use this logger service logger spy instead of like this we can use it directly okay so like this if you want the logger spy also you can use so this one logger spy and you can inject this one and you can get it now if you try to see the output let's try to see the thing so everything got success and here if you try to see here see everything got success so no nothing no problem post competitors everything got success so here if you try to see and this one is also working so this is how we will be injecting this test bed configuration test bed into the service which has a dependencies normally some people what they will try to do is i will show you another scenario also so instead of using this before each why because so this one will create some confusion why because if you try to see the test case so without knowing whatever whatever the thing it is happening previously without knowing anything so this test is getting passed so we cannot able to know it right so some people what they will try to do is so here they will try to create function okay setup so they will create some method something like function setup and nothing what they will try to do is so here these are the things they will try to copy it okay up to here they will copy it and they will paste it here so here they will have something like constant and here this one is also of constant and they will return this calculator and logger service spy that's it okay so they will re return like this and this is the setup method now there is no need of this before each method and let logger size spy and these are all the things there is no need okay everything gone so here they will add it in the setup method and in this setup method what i will that they will try to do is so here they want this calculate logger service right so here they will use something like constant and what is the first return value it is having so calculator and the logger service by right so calculator and logger they will use the destructuring thing logger service is equal to setup they will call the setup method that's it so now it is useful and here also you will be able to add it here so it does the same thing so nothing no problem now if you try to see the code so let's try to see the code so what is that here it is getting error so what we have did so nothing is there right setup and all those things is done we have used the constant constant and everything we have used it and we have removed the before each so this is the describe method okay so let's try to run it again okay still we are getting error what is the error we are getting here it is telling that describe with no children describe or it is duplicated okay so we are using some data inside the describe without using the it okay 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 so here we need to use it in the it only we should not use it in outside we are using okay fine that's it right so let's try to see the output and here if we try to see the output it's done everything and here let's try to see it refresh it again yeah everything got passed it see so this is also another way how we can implement the without using the before reach so now if you try to see here what we have did we have created a setup and we are calling this function setup thing every time whenever a test case is followed so now you will be able to understand very easily that okay for first we need to call the setup so that means first we need to get the calculator service instance and the logger service instance and you can use it and here also we can use it some people they will be using uh, before each why because it will be uh, that is a traditional approach but the using the before each what they will try to do is so the people will get confused the code will not look cleaner and something like that and uh, they will be using like this setup method so that for every test case they will call the setup so this before each method so similar way the before each method how it will execute so here also it will try to execute so we will proceed it with the before each i am showing you the another another version also how we can how the some people will be using like this so this is how they will be using or otherwise we can use the before each also nothing the these two things are doing one and the same so it is getting executed each time whenever whenever before executing the test that's it so hope you understood about this one if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you